morning I had this vision in my mind of like my ideal day my ideal life and I kept thinking that like one day I'll just jump from where I'm at straight into that and that's just not possible like that's just not how this shit happens I can never get it when I'm on the ground you can never get it when you pull me down even when I fall let's be open now something about the space that I honor now something about the race of the richest town something about this place falling down I don't wanna glow up just to watch you drown This ain't Holly Choco, we in fighting now Hey, it's Zana. So this video is about looking at how far you've come Because literally the past few weeks I have been forced to learn this lesson And god damn it, it's so difficult But I want to talk about it because it's so so important and it's key And when you really internalise what that means like the mental space of gratitude that it puts you in is so so powerful and will seriously change your life and I know that people say about gratitude all the time but when you actually get there and you like feel it <laughs> it literally changes your life it changes your outlook on your life and for me this time last year like I was struggling just to put out fucking cover songs you know and it, now I'm about to drop my second EP so so much can happen in a year that just last year I like literally had no self-esteem I was terrified to get on camera I was not comfortable on camera at all I was not comfortable in my own skin didn't know who I was like I just got out of the most abusive fucking relationship you can imagine and I think like even to talk about that even now freaks me the fuck out <laughs> but I think maybe I will do like maybe a story time or something like that and go further into that because my ultimate goal is to help people and I know that it's important for us to share our experiences and traumas even and like mental state especially for me like that's what I feel like my purpose is so I do want to do it but it just takes me a bit of time to get there you know and I feel like now I'm getting a bit more comfortable on camera so I do want to start going into different things that I've been through and that kind of thing but yeah for now we're just like we're we're working our way up to it okay <laughs> so when I look at like where I was this time last year the difference is insane but yet we forget like we forget how far we've come and we beat ourselves up for not being where we want to be you know like we tend to be so focused on where we want to be, where we're headed, that we forget that we've actually made so many steps towards it, like literally so many steps, and that where you were last year is not where you are right now, you know, so much can happen in that short space of time, and I feel like it's so important, and I'm really having to learn this goddamn lesson right now, that we literally reflect more, and like appreciate ourselves and be proud of ourselves and be grateful for ourselves and the fact that we've actually moved forward you know like we've healed certain things we've let go of certain things we've let go of certain people you know like so much happens and we literally forget and like we take it for granted or you know like I'm so guilty of this where I feel guilty for appreciating myself like I feel like that's such a programmed belief but I always would beat myself up for the slightest things and then even if I achieved something I felt like I wasn't worthy enough to celebrate myself for it you know like it would seem like I was big-headed or something so I wouldn't even acknowledge the fact that I achieved something you know and I'm realizing now more and more that like it's so important to congratulate yourself like to literally celebrate every single step to really appreciate yourself for every single step that you take every single achievement no matter how small it is no matter how silly it is like it's important and the more that we do that the more that we build up our self-esteem you know and it's so easy to like lack confidence i feel like in today's world with so much competition so much expectation like so many standards and norms that are like pretty high you know like literally the standard of beauty is surgically enhanced like it's not even a real person you know so like when things are this unattainable basically we then don't appreciate ourselves for the simple small things you know that we literally work towards every day and that we achieve every day and the small things add up 
and they do matter. So I just wanted to share my kind of experience a little bit and the journey of going from like no self-esteem whatsoever to now sitting here filming videos three times a week and putting out music and all of that kind of stuff and this time last year I never ever ever would have thought that I'd be doing it you know like never I always wanted to like I knew in my heart and soul that like I could picture it you know Pisces we live in the dream realm I could see it but I didn't really believe that it would happen that it would become reality you know and I feel like that is the issue for many many people is that we don't believe in ourselves and like we doubt ourselves a lot but if you would look at how far you've come if you would look at all of the steps that you have taken that have led you to here like that's huge that's so many things and you should be proud of those you really should be proud of those no matter what anyone else says no matter what they're thinking this is about you this is about your path this is about what you want and like the goal is not a destination it's the journey of getting there, you know, because the goalposts move all the time. So even when you do get that thing, there's another thing that you want. It's the same with material possession, you know, even when you get one outfit, you want another. When you get one car, you want another because it moves because it's not like you'll never be satisfied. But what you can be satisfied with is like appreciating yourself and enjoying the journey, enjoying the process, and being able to look back and be like, wow, I did that, like, wow, I was there, and now I'm here, you know, because oftentimes when you're moving, you don't even notice the steps that you've taken, like, you don't even notice that you've actually taken 10 steps towards where you want to be, like, you don't even realise that that's how many steps you've taken, you might think you've only taken one, you know, because every day we can literally be moving forward. Every day we can literally be doing things to better ourselves, even from making a better food choice, even from stopping a thought when it comes in. Like all of those things, no matter how small, add up to like huge, huge change, you know. And for so, so long, I kept thinking that change would just be this like miraculous thing. I had this vision in my mind of like my ideal day my ideal life and I kept thinking that like one day I'll just jump from where I'm at straight into that and that's just not possible like that's just not how this shit happens it's a daily gradual thing you know making small changes and then before you know it your life looks like that thing that you envisioned but then when you're in it you might not even realize that it's the life that you envision because your vision will move and it will move to another thing you know because that's just the way this shit works our minds and the things that we want and the things that we're heading towards always change and even our purpose can change you know because you like you get to know yourself more so then things that you thought before that you could never do you start to believe that you can so then you want to do that thing you know like I'm just realizing that the restrictions are not needed <laughs> and I put so many restrictions on myself and cage myself in into this like ideal vision and it doesn't need to be that it doesn't need to be so structured and so intense and so difficult and so like I mean it's just unattainable and it doesn't need to be that because you've come so far and where you're going like you're moving towards that every single day with any little thing that you do you know and you should be celebrating that you should be loving yourself for that and I'm realizing how key gratitude is because when you notice those things like it literally lights a fire in you so then you want to do the next change you want to keep going you know like it's just so powerful when it builds momentum and yeah I just wanted to talk about it because I'm having to learn this and internalize this right now because I kept closing myself in and trying to like force this ideal image on myself as if I was going to be able to just jump into doing a thousand new things at once and you can't make that many changes because you won't stick to it. You have to do one thing at a time and be consistent with it and if you fall off one day it's fine next day you pick yourself back up you know like if you fall off for five days it's fine then the next day after that you pick yourself back up like it's just noticing your mind noticing what you want seeing your vision meditating on it you know getting comfortable in your own skin believing in yourself believing that it will happen and then appreciating every step of the way appreciating yourself every step of the way and being able to look back and appreciate every single step that led you to where you are at 
because they all matter, they were all a part of your purpose, all a part of the plan, you already agreed to it before you came here, so it's completely necessary, and even though certain things could be avoided, you still had to go through it, like, you still had to, otherwise you wouldn't have, you know, so, yeah, I just think we should be celebrating ourselves, <laughs> I feel like I said that in such an English accent, <laughs> but anyway, so yeah, I hope this video was just, I don't know, a little bit positive for your day, but yeah, I want to start showing some like personal things as well of where I'm at and all that kind of stuff, so look out for more videos, hit the notification bell, then you'll be notified when I upload, but thank you so much for watching, all the links for my music, social media, my merch company which is launching so soon, all of those links will be in the description box below, and yeah. Until next time, I'll see you in the next video. Bye. I need a man that will hold me down. If he a yes man, I ain't keeping him around. I need a